And there's Hillary Clinton looking ebullient, I think is the word, after a very tiring week. And you know, Chris, she, I'm sure she heard some of Obama, and she knows that she still has a formidable, formidable trail ahead of her because that was, once again, a very impressive political speech. But this is her night, and her night plus. Uh, you pick any metaphor that you want. The debut at the Met, winning the Super Bowl, uh, getting uh, a big, big prize, because yesterday she was in a very emotional, almost meltdown moment, saying it's very hard to go forward. The night before, people had said, you. you know, they like Obama better than you. Now let's listen to Hillary Clinton on the most triumphant night, really, Thank of her you. political Thank career. You. tonight with a very, very full heart, and I want, I want especially to thank New Hampshire. Over the last week, I listened to you, and in the process, I found my own voice. our hearts and I am so gratified that you responded. Now together, let's give America the kind of comeback that New Hampshire has just given me. What was the defining moment? You know, you, you go back to these defining moments that change an election. Ronald, let's just, we'll stay in New Hampshire. Ronald Reagan grabbing the mic, saying, I paid for the mic, Mr. Green. Ed Muskie tearing up what, in 1972. What was the defining moment that flipped, again, a double-digit lead in 24 hours? I think it was what Hillary Clinton spoke about tonight in saying she found her voice. I think she re- discovered the rationale for her candidacy was which is to make her own history to remind women and people of the state that there is a first in electing a woman